Hello there everybody, I'm Bix here with another Lego discussion and I've been doing a lot of these though this is the last one. Sorry about the terrible focus, huh? Well, this should be the last one for a while, there we go. And, um, and then I'll probably do three tips and tricks videos. But anyway, um, today's topic is, should Lego sets stay longer? So think of last year's, yes, just last year's 2018 sets. Majority of those sets are only available in that year of 2018. You can definitely find them at like Walmarts and Targets um, by 2019, you know, the ones that didn't get sold, but in Lego stores is 2018. And even in Walmarts and Targets, you know, you'll find the 2018 sets until the end of 2019. In 2020, it will be so hard to find them. You'll have to go online onto eBay, and other sites where you'll have to pay a lot of money for them. So the question today is, should Lego let them stay on the market for longer? For sets to be able to stay on the market for, let's say, three years a set. So here's why this would definitely help. Because um, let's take a set, okay. So there's so many sets, Lego releases around, rounding up here though, not down, here let's be exact, around 350 sets per year. Now uh, I could imagine a kid not wanting all of them, well obviously kids want all of them, but realistically, you know, sets that they'd be willing to pay for, I could imagine them wanting a hundred of those sets. I could imagine them getting 10 to maximum 20 of those sets and then they can't get the other 80 they want and then they're like oh I can save up next year and then they get another 10 sets but there are still 70 that they want and then they're like oh I can get them next year but by that year it will be 2020 and then they can't get them so and that's uh, even a problem I faced. Like I wanted the this year's, um, last year's, sorry, City Hospital. I wanted the Outdoor Adventures. But there were so many Harry Potter sets and Star Wars sets and Marvel sets I wanted that I wasn't able to get those. I hope I can get them this year. But this year, so many new sets came out that I can't get them. And then the question really boils down to should Lego keep sets on the market for longer? For example, UCS's Assault on Hoth was um a ucs that everybody hates anyway um i think it came out in 2017 and um the assault in that set were two snow troopers and a speeder and a cannon yeah that's it but anyway um that was just outrageous but um the designer's excuse and flimsy excuse was that last year lego had put in out um hoth sets which they had they had i'll give them that um but by the time that the 2017 hot set was out you can't get the 2016 sets at least not on lego.com or lego stores so that was another problem you know but yeah that's just it for this discussion i guess it's just um i think i would definitely like to see lego sets stay on the market longer but yeah that's it for this video and i hope you liked it and if you did please subscribe leave a comment down below and i'll talk to you again soon bye